the tragic case of Shankwella Robinson, a 25-year-old Charlotte woman who died during a trip to Cabo in late October, is now being investigated as a homicide after her family publicly questioned the original version of events as purported by the friends she was with when she died. Her family's concerns led to more attention on social media, in-depth local reporting from outlets such as WSOC, and eventually a second look from investigators, who on Thursday announced that they no longer believed Robinson's death was accidental. According to Robinson's mother, Shankwella's friends originally insisted that she had died of alcohol poisoning, though it was later uncovered that an autopsy report listed her cause of death as severe spinal cord injury and atlas luxation with no mention of alcohol. After multiple other inconsistencies in the investigation, including a record that stated yes in a column that asked whether the death was accidental or violent, authorities in Baja California Sur, where Shankwella died, announced on Thursday that her death is now being investigated as a femicide. According to WSOC, many homicides in Mexico that involve women as victims are investigated as femicides until it can be proven that gender did not play a role in her killing. As reported by WSOC's Joe Bruno on Wednesday, a video has surfaced showing a woman attacking Shanquella in what appears to be a beachside resort. The FBI announced on Friday that it has also opened a probe into Robinson's death.